Hey and welcome back to the revolution and some more WWE 2K19 news as while I was sleeping 2K revealed a very cheeky sneak peek look at all three members of the Riot Squad in this year's game. Earlier in the week as part of the roster reel hosted by Lana and Rusev, 2K showed off a brief look at Ruby Riot's entrance in this year's game with this amazing new screenshot hot on the heels. As part of the showcase, 2K have also showcased the ratings for all three members of the Riot Squad with Liv Morgan being rated as 71. Ruby Riot is 80 and Liv Morgan is 70. I will admit when it comes to the ratings, I personally aren't phased by the numbers either way as it's not something I ever take into account whilst playing the game. As long as the women look and play good, then consider me happy. But I do know that quite a few of you love to get down to the nitty gritty and compare each one by the books. So before we get too mathematical, let's take a look at the Riot Squad up close, starting with the incredible, and my god do I mean incredible, looking Liv Morgan. Honestly, I thought Pete Dunne looked the most realistic, but when it comes to Liv Morgan's model, holy cow! I can safely say that Liv Morgan has now taken over as best looking model, and I hope this is just the start of some awesome things to come. While I was hoping Liv would be sporting her attire from the Royal Rumble earlier this year, she is in fact wearing her gear from the Clash of Champions from back in December of last year. Regardless, Liv still looks absolutely amazing, and with help from the creation suite, it takes me seconds for fans to switch up Liv's colour palette and give her that edgy Riot Squad attire. Moving on to Ruby Riot, who we had a brief look at earlier this week. I have to say the entrance clip didn't quite do the model justice in the screenshot. Ruby is looking so much better. Like Liv, Ruby's also spotting her Clash of Champions 2017 attire, and I have to say, me personally, I'm pretty damn pleased with how good she looks. Ruby has easily become one of my favourites over the last year, and I for one can't wait to play as Riot and kick some ass. Next up is the third member of the Riot Squad, Sarah Logan, who also makes her video game debut alongside tag team partner Liv Morgan. Unlike Ruby and Liv, Sarah seems to be sporting her Smackdown Live debut attire as opposed to the Clash of Champions attire that's seen on the former two. However, just like in Liv's case, Sarah's format has pretty much stayed the same over time and it will take me a second to switch up the colours and throw on the Riot Squad t-shirt to make her feel brand new. Like her tag team partners, I think Sarah looks bloody brilliant <laughs> and I can't wait to see if we get any of her unique in-ring moves such as that vicious headbutt. Honestly, I have to say the Riot Squad are looking absolutely fabulous and I can't wait to see this faction tear up the WWE game scene over the next year. While they may have not had a huge push over on Raw, they have quickly become a huge staple of the women's division and I for one would love to see some gold on either of the women. It also looks like we might be getting that Riot Squad trio entrance that so many of us have been dying for thanks to that official Riot Squad Titantron hiding in the background. Over the last few years, all we've had to play with is the Bella Twins entrance as well as some generic preset entrances so it's about damn time we had some new female tag team entrances in the mix. It also gives some hearts to the likes of Absolution who remained a stable in WWE until Paige was hired on the Raw after WrestleMania 34. So that's our brief look at the Riot Squad in this year's game and God am I happy. I honestly can't wait to get my hands on this year's game and I hope the screenshot has you hyped just as much as it does me. Let us know in the comments below what you make of the models for all three members of the Riot Squad as well as what your take on the rating system is. Don't forget to stay tuned to The Revolution for all the latest women's roster news, footage and so much more.